video we talk about another important type of function called as many one into function. In the previous videos we have already covered these important seven types of functions. Now this is a function next in the series. What is many one into function? Let's get started. Now we've already studied what is a many one function? what is a into function and combining both of them we have many one into function. Let's get started by writing the definition and then see a working problem for the same. So the definition of many one into function would go as a function which is both a function which is both many one and into a function which is both many one and into. Now what was many one function? Many one function was the one which was not one one. That means different elements could have obtained the same image. And what about into function? Into function was the one which was not onto. That means range was not equal to codomain. It was actually the subset of codomain. Now combining these, we have a working problem and this new concept of many one into function. Let's see what the example problem says. Suppose I have a function called as fx is equal to x square. That means it is a square function. Now this function say is from integers to integers only z is integers, the function has range, we will calculate, domain, integers, codomain, integers. Now integers can also contain negative values, they can also contain positive values, they can also contain a zero. So let's see what happens when we actually go about solving this problem. Can you observe one fact in this problem? that when x is equal to minus 1, minus 1 square will give me 1 and when x is actually equal to 1, 1 square would also give me 1. That means different elements have got one same image. Hence, this is not 1 1, rather this is many 1 function. Now, let's see whether it is onto or into. If we put different values, do we get something which is range equal to codomain or do we get something which is range a subset of codomain? Let us put x is equal to 1. When x is equal to 1, the function will get the value of 1. When you put x is equal to 2, when you put x is equal to 2, 2 square will give me 4. When you put x is equal to 3, you get 9 and so on. Similarly, moving left hand side of the number line, when you put x is equal to 0, you get 0. When you put x is equal to minus 1, you get 1 and so on. So the function actually does not have all the integers present. It only has a few integers present in the line. Hence, the range cannot be equal to the codomain. So the range is a subset of codomain and hence this is not an onto function rather into function. Now combining both these things that it is many one and into we have it as a many one into function which is written here and I put the stick mark completing all the types of functions. So in this video we completed the last type of function called as many one into function. 